We start with Jurgen Klopp, who has described the signing of Cody Hapko as a home run. Hapko signed a five-and-a-half-year deal from PSV Eindhoven and could make his debut against Wolves on the 7th of January, although Klopp didn't rule out the game against Brentford on the 2nd. The answer is pretty easy. It's obvious because he's a really, really, really good player. So the, the package is really interesting. The edge is in is in the potentially shows the, the um, or has and uh, the quality he, he showed already um, in Holland and um, with the national team as well. So it makes him a really, really interesting player, and um, that's why we were very interested um, to get him in. And I'm really happy that we could do it. So. Big for us, really big for him as well. So it's cool. He's obviously delighted about um, joining us, and um, yeah, everything will be good. So great, great day. Let me say it like this. Just did you have Virgil having a word with him as well? By the way, it's in the of these some of these nice moments when you are Liverpool manager, the manager of Liverpool FC, and you run, you realize you think you have to convince somebody, and then you realize when you talk, oh, the door is wide open. So. This is more or less a home run, um, and it was it was cool. Then, um, so we didn't need Virgil to 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 convince him, um, and but after that, obviously Virgil is anyway likes to be involved in these kind of things, and from a specific moment on, he had his say as well. But all good. And when he might be available? What I heard now, so we are obviously very early, um, which is good. Um, there might be a chance for Brentford, but I, I think not really, to be honest. Um, uh, because obviously, first of January is the bank holiday, and then um, the, 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 all the papers which we don't have to sign, but some other people yeah, would have to be signed on the second until twelfth, so lunchtime. <laughs> I'm I'm not too positive that that will happen. So, but we don't we will not rush it anyway. So, um, probably uh, Wolves. Liverpool will pay up to £45 million for the Dutch international. Klopp told us he would have been unaffordable had he been excelling in one of Europe's other major leagues. So there's, he's a young player with a lot of potential. If he, if he would, would have been already in a different position, so like scoring 40 goals and not in Holland but in Spain or whatever, unaffordable. So it's in, in these kind of things, it's all about timing. Getting these boys in the right moment that they didn't already score 55 goals per season, stuff like this. So it's really, and that's why we we were really convinced that we could follow. Let's say he always made a step. He always made the next step, and um, and that um, makes it so interesting. And we believe in our process. Obviously, when when players here coming come here, or especially offensive players. They actually all made a step forward, and um, because the way we we work and the way we can help them, um, and that makes it massively um, interesting. Klopp also revealed Liverpool are hopeful of making further signings in the transfer window, but he wasn't giving too much away. We discuss these things in the boardroom and not in the press room. So, um, and on top of that, what was the, the, to bring in Cody in the way we brought him in, for example, is again a, a really good sign, and especially the, the job Jules did was exceptional. And um, well, quite a few people were involved and knew about it. And anyway, nothing came out, which is very, very helpful um, in, in, in all departments. And um, I think that worked out for us quite frequently. And that's why you will not really expect me to answer your question. But I would say, in principle, it's like this for all all people in the world. The money you spend has an impact on the money you can spend. Not. So it's not that it increased, uh, but it's not nothing. No, it's, it has nothing to do with each other. So really not. We 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 know what we want to do, and we will see if we can do it. Um, and it's yes, it's about money, of course, but it's more about um, how it always was about the right players. And we are really, really happy that we could get Cody.